That's right, and Carson Hosevar and the 42 team makes the gamble. You have the lead late in the race, not able to bring this one home. The team tells you that even if you don't win, you're probably still going to get in. You don't, so how do you process that? I don't know. I don't, I don't know how you're supposed to handle these. As many times as I come in close, I should be used to this. But, I mean, I'm going to be my bride, a bridesmaid at my own wedding. I don't, I don't know. Um, I thought I didn't say, or I saved too much um, and could have gone harder and moved, built the gap. But um, off of, or into three on the coming to white flag, I started sputtering. So I knew it was game over. The 19 had an issue, and I lost three seconds there. So um, looking back, I wish I could have got those back. But I mean, Phil, Phil Gould made a hell of a call that even I didn't, I didn't see it. I, I have 56 laps to go. There, there's going to be yellow, right? It's Cut off race, and you know it's the truck series of all things. So I was sitting there shaking my head. I'm like, yeah, okay, you know we we're run 18th or 20th, but um, made the right call. Um, a little bit better position on my part, just in that one. I mean, how are you supposed to know the 19s got to have a flat right in front of me? But um, he deserved to win that race. Worldwide Express deserved to win that race. Um, just on strategy, we were nowhere near the fast car. Um, Kyle needs to go to. Or RCR, wherever he was going, just so he can. Uh, I don't have to run the, against the four truck as much, but it seems like I always run second to that. Um, but uh, they were the class of the field all night, and um, yeah, just got got beat. Uh, had the winning strategy, just um, just obviously didn't work out. Thanks for your time, Carson. Jamie.